Okay, I'm doing like a little two video series because I did another. I did this video last week, but I I just couldn't finish it, and uh, I'm just doing it again. So, people that complain about the shop being slow, um, first of all, anybody can make it in any business anywhere, but um, when you complain about things being slow, that's a really bad way. Uh, no one gives a shit about you. So, um, a good way. To increase your volume, and you, even if you're new at the shop, is number one, the most important thing, is just be friendly. Greet the customers when they come in, right? So if I'm the owner of the shop, and I have a big full book, and you're the new guy, okay? And my customers are coming in, make sure you introduce yourself. Say, hey, I'm Bob, or whatever your name is. Introduce yourself. Try to connect with that person, even though it's my customer, I don't like to say that, but let's say it's a client of mine. Let's say I go out of town next week. Well, you connected with that client, so he's going to need a haircut. He's going to, oh, shit, Cody is busy this week. Let me see who else is available. Oh, well, I remember Bob, um, him and I were talking about that basketball game or whatever. I'll try him out, right? So the whoever they connected with the most in the shop is who they're going to jump in the chair with. They're not going to sit in your chair if you make them feel uncomfortable. It's that simple. Be personable. Be clean. Don't smell like cigarettes. Don't smell like hungover that you don't do your laundry. Keep yourself clean. Be friendly. Greet the customers. You know who my some of my favorite customers are the older guys. The guys that are older than my grandpa. Because I treat them with just as much love and respect as I do the young guys. They love me. You know, I connect with them. So it's, it doesn't matter. Nothing matters. Anyone connect, can connect with anybody else. And it's not even about money. It's just about trying to be happy. You know, the world's a tough place. But when you're at the shop, make that shop a happy environment because it's going to be good for everybody in the shop. You know, now if you're in a shop where you're not happy and you're feeling miserable, maybe it's time for you to go somewhere else and find a shop that you're going to grow that or open your own shop. But... When you are, give it give it a shot, you know. Put in the time, put in the effort, and be friendly and greet people. And you'd be surprised how far that will take you. Um, greeting the customers is probably one of the most important um, things because when they come in, they feel welcome. And when people feel welcome, they want to come back. Getting to know people by first name is even better. Now, as a new barber, you're not going to do that, obviously, but... Try to remember or look on your booking software. And when it says, okay, Bob's coming in. And you know, oh, yeah, I cut his hair two weeks ago and I cut it six weeks ago. You can say, hey, Bob, even if you don't remember his name. Hey, Bob, how are you? Take a little note. How are you, How was your son's soccer game? Be personable. Be a human. Interact with your customers because your interaction with them, maybe the only human interaction they have. They may work from home. They may have hardly any friends. So be that person that, that they enjoy being around. You'll be surprised how busy you will be, how successful you can be. You might be able to be a successful barber like me one day. All right. Have a great day. I'll talk to you soon.